you were mentally when you go on court every day and you don't complain when you play bad, when you have problems, when you have pains. Today we will talk about the virtues of effort to succeed in life, and how Nadal already had it instilled in him from a very young age. Don't forget to subscribe, like and comment. Rafa Nadal is an example in many things, but above all in effort. Few athletes represent the value of work as much as the boy from Monaco, whose fruits have given him not only success as one of the best tennis players of all time, but also economic success. That virtue of effort was instilled in him from a very early age. An example of this are the statements that have gone viral two decades after they were made. Ahora, ¿qué piensas hacer? Seguir entrenando, a ver. No sé. Creo que es importante este torneo, pero tampoco no para ganar este torneo no quiere decir que seas, no, que vas a ser muy bueno. Se tiene que seguir entrenando y vamos a ver. In this statement, a very young Nadal, only 14 years old, vindicates the value of effort and continuous training after winning the Junior Players Tournament in Tarbes, France. Now what do you plan to do? The reporter asks him. Keep training. I think it's important to win this tournament, but winning it doesn't mean you're going to be very good. You have to keep training, and we'll see, replies a very mature Nadal despite his age. Not two years had passed since he made these statements when Nadal, at almost 16, won his first match on the ATP circuit against the Paraguayan Ramon Delgado. The rest is tennis history. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like and comment.